Hello guys, make sure to check out my website, thecombatsystem.com, thecombatsystem.com, or catchjitsu.com for all things up to jitsu, self-defense, combat, etc. Anyway, today guys, I'm doing a first impressions, first shots, first impressions video just to the CM9. Now I'm going to do the CZP07. Now, I just throw, throw my SIG out there so I can take it out of my holster, take it off my hip. And that gun is live charged, but just for a size comparison here is the P07 to the P320C. They're very similar. Both of us hold 15.1. Of course, this is a PSA gun. Or I guess you could call it the lock. Uh, that's a little questionable. But anyway. Um, it is a DEA for this guy. Anyway, I won't go into that. It's a DASA um, firearm. I might be wrong on that. But DASA, and uh, I'm not a DASA guy. I'm completely a striker guy. My first shots might completely suck right now. But that's what a lot of you might be asking yourself as well. You can find this gun. It's a great quality gun for pretty cheap. Cheap being uh, 410 or 480, I suppose. Uh, mine, uh, 410 being a kind of fakish cast price, so really it's probably like 427, something on there. Uh, that's a guesstimate. I got loaded 10 up here. It feels pretty good in the hand. Pretty decent sights. Uh, pretty good double action. Very awesome single action. Controls are decent, the decocker is good. I do have to rotate it, and I got big XL hands. I gotta rotate it to drop the slide. That's not awesome, but. Mag release, okay. So here I can't, I can't reach the slide stop That's lever. I have to rotate it, I gotta roll it in my hand. Yeah. Decocker, decocker's okay. Good sink, good double action. I mean, I'm not a DA guy, so my shot's probably gonna be all over the place. Decent sight picture there, guys. Let me zoom in on that a little bit. Single action is very nice. There's a DA. Get easy dry fire practice. That's something else. Nice VA auto probably helps you better overall as a shooter. Maybe I should pick one up. Um, so you're not destabilizing the sights on the pistol as you're pulling through the trigger. If you get good at the VA, hey, you get better at just about everything. The single action. I'll see you. Good shoot. Two. Little take up. Wall. And super light, but now this is a range rifle, so it's probably gotten really broken in, really, really broken in, and lighter. But that's pretty idea, guys. Uh, I like the pistol. It feels pretty nice. It's a thick gun, but in in the in the palm, it's actually fairly thin up here, right in this area. But something doesn't feel quite right about the beaver tail to me. Kind of like is already hurting my hand even before filming this video. So I'm not sure about it. I held the PO9 yesterday. The PO9 feels great. It's just huge. No one's going to carry that. Uh, a giant. Um, so it doesn't feel great, but it feels pretty good. But there's definitely something about the beaver tail kind of cutting into um, the, the, the where you would throat strike something. Bam! The web of the hand. So anyway, uh, let's do some shots and first impressions. Guys, I'm going to charge it, decock it, throw it in a holster. I have a very generic, generic holster um, that I don't use because it's kind of crappy. Um, I brought it to the range just in case. Uh, it's actually molded for a G26 or G19. But it seems to fit. Well, I need to shave. Anyway, just seeing if you like my first impressions video. Uh, guys, shout out to 1776 United. Nice. And uh, anyway, I'm at five yards. I set up a fresh target there so I could see how far I throw the shots. There are three shots there earlier, two in the X-ring, one there in the nine uh, from the CM9. I put it, I don't put this 
targets. I usually don't use these targets. If I do, I figure out right there that the real uh, heart would be for a target this size. That's how I like to shoot. I don't like to shoot people down. Okay. So. I'm going to charge it. And it stays in the semi-cock, I believe. That's why you get a pretty nice uh, first trigger pull. Decent, anyway. Careful recoil on this generic hole size. And I'm going to go on pretty quick and shoot if I can. Uh, the first is probably going to go way left because I'm not a DA guy. Let's see. You ready? Back off, dude. I don't want trouble. Stay away, man. All right. Let's see. How bad was it? Is it decent? Is it bad? Is this something if I practiced with I could carry? Oh, hey. If, if all I did was throw my first shot high, if I'm centered, actually, I am, I'm okay with that. So if I practice with this pistol, I'm okay with that, you know, even though it's just a, a bit high. I'm at five yards with 115 SMB. That's interesting that they weren't low and left, that they're just centered but high. Okay. I assume most people uh, watching my channel are probably younger striker guys and if you guys are more DA experts uh, DASA experts feel You know free to chime in now. I'm gonna decock again before we holstering. Ah, see I'm not trying to do that So I would have to decide If I would possibly switch over to carrying a DA this this is a pistol that interests me uh, I think I'm looking at the FNS 9. I'll do next instead. They were striker fired but as far as the BASA, I think the PO7 is a, a good choice for people. All right, shoot it ready. Stay away, man. I don't want any trouble. Keep your distance, please. Keep your distance. All right, I think one was way left, one was way right. I'm only at five yards. Let's see. Well, there's one. One of them's good, surprisingly. Yeah, there's the other one. Okay, so I think my first DA shot was there, and that was my second SA shot. DA being double action, SA being single action. Not awesome, but not horrible. Okay, so I fired four shots. I got six more in the mag. I'm gonna do uh, two triple tap going DA to SA, and let's because uh, I'm curious about the third shot. First, transition how much training it really takes for a guy who is used to uh, striker fired or you know perhaps like single action 1911. That's really where most of my firearms training is in my whole life. Most of Okay, shooter ready. Let's see, I'm doing two triple taps. So a triple tap and then I'll reholster. Okay, wait a minute. Hey dude, I don't want any trouble, man. I don't want any Hmm, okay. I don't know if the camera could replay it. There's one. That's earlier from the CM9. That was earlier. Oh, where are my other two shots? I'm gonna take the time point and then now, guys. I don't know where my other two shots are. Oh, there's one. Okay, those two are earlier. Oh, and there's two next to each other there. Oh, maybe uh, all three of those are on what? I think that's about equivalent to a four by six. That's a 50 uh, yard, I think. 
a 22 rifle. That's a good thing to buy, by the way, to keep throwing on targets for cheap to get to like a acceptable combat shooting zone, in my opinion, for the upper thoracic. So if that was like one, two, three, maybe if all three are on there, that's not bad considering, guys, I really, I, it's been years since I shot a DASA. I'm gonna do it one more time. Uh, and actually, I'm starting, to, I'm starting to like this pistol quite a bit. First shots, first impressions, it's starting to feel better in my hand. Even the beaver, you know, I'm picking it up. It's a little, it's a little slippery. I wonder if I felt that. If the front, uh, the front is good. The back little dots are okay. Uh, it's just the type of palmer. It's a little slippery. This is okay. I guess it's up here by the um, That feels even more slippery to me. Than the plastic on the rig, and this thing has the nice... The P3 definitely feels better to me. But, if you're looking for a DS and you're new to shooting, and for some reason a, a lighter striker fired take up trigger scares you. I'm thinking it's got a I might even get I gotta train a decock before we holstering. I'm worried about that after a defensive gun use. You know, you hear the cops rolling up and then you uh, shoot yourself in the leg. That's that's not the great end of a six you know what would have been a successful defensive gun use. So I still don't know, but if that's what we're going to let's do this one more time. Stay away, dude. Hey, man. You're in trouble? No, no, man. No. I'm just going to go my way. Sorry, I, I don't have any money. Three of those dragging in the line. Guys, are there any other shots? Sorry, but this is first shot, first impressions. Without replaying it, I'm just trying to call my shots. If three are jagged there, and I didn't have a perfect sight picture. I kind of was just, you know, more. I, I, I was lined up perfectly. I was probably a little slow to my first shot. I'm trying to make sure that it worked. That's, that's not. So the striker fire. Other than anyway, first impressions are solid pistol. Solid pistol. Um, at least after some that DA trigger smooths out, I'm sure a bit. So you come I might have just caught the CZ bug. I should get a 75 in my hand. Ten shots. First impressions with the CZ POC. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed it. Some other videos coming your way. Cheers.